conversion. Seven points to Uganda. Zambia with zero. Excellent start. Aaron of Woods. Kick off the last time was a bit errant. He didn't target the Ugandan uh, uh, runners and Zambia almost punished them. Let's see if he corrects it now and uh, gets the ball available for competition. And I think he does in this case because Ian Munyani is up for it. Zambia knocks the ball backwards. Munyani gets the ball and uh, behind the scrum. Kisiga in the midfield and uh, Philip Okorach on the wing. Casito takes the ball on himself in the line. Ofora was in the midfield attacking the Zambian line. He beats one man. He's got Philip Okorach outside him. It doesn't need him. Philip gets the ball. Oh, the yes. pass sticks and a try <laughs> is scored by the rugby cranes with their super talisman. Philip Wokarach going over after an excellent pass. Pressure. Uganda releases the ball. Big tackle by um, Zambia, but it was illegal on that breakdown, and that's a penalty advantage to Uganda. Casito takes it quickly. He's attacking the line. This man is a speedster. Great tackle by the Zambians. Uganda still has the ball in the, uh, at that rack, but uh, unfortunately for them, they did not release you in need the tackle. You to stay on your feet there. Yes, indeed, but you, uh, Ian Munyani with the ball. Switch back in for Michael Wokoraj. Still has the ball. The Excellent floor. pass to Aaron Oforewood for the second try for Uganda. Fantastic play by the rugby cranes. Uganda extends the lead with a good team try. Yeah, that's a very good team try. Started Strong carry ball, ball and man. Ball and man together. Big run by the Zambians. Zambia is bossing the play back inside. Big tackle there by Uganda. Knocked forward. Timothy Kisiga. Fantastic defense. Well played. To show the same in attack. Casito with the feed. Midfield. Show and go. Timothy Kisiga. Out to Philip Wokorat. Sizes his man outside. Good pass inside oh, to that's a beautiful pass. Captain Michael <laughs> Okorat for a centre post try. Fantastic play by Uganda. Oh, that's a beautiful pass. That's slow and calm. Michael Philip Okorat takes the contact, commits two men, frees his hands, and gives his captain a very easy try. His captain and his name set Michael Okorat to score an easy try under the uprights. The Ugandan fans are on their feet. There's nobody who is sitting in the stands. They are jumping up and down and jubilating with their team after having such a successful opening day. That try actually demonstrates the good com communication that Uganda has as a team. Fantastic uh, interplay from Adrian Casito and Timothy Kisiga. Ball goes out wide. Philip Wokorach is able to gather the defense and a nice inside pass to his captain, Michael Wokorach, to go all the way to the center post. Fantastic play by Uganda. The Hooter for half time at hand. They were able to breach the Zambian defense and score a try. Yeah, very, very uh, emphatic display from Zambia. They are being, they're, every chance that they get is being squeezed out by the Ugandan defense. But you can see that once they get in their element, that carry by Kalumba, Israel, uh, with, with Adrian Casito, that short ball that uh, Chimbukulu was able to consolidate that ball and still stay on his feet. Excellent play. However, he got off his feet and lost the ball forward. Ian Munyani got off his feet. Something's happening on that side of the field. Everybody's losing their feet. However, ball going wide. Michael Okorach with his eye error. Two on one. Okorach doesn't need his man. And he goes to score his uh, hat trick for this game. And the captain leading from the front. Yeah, Michael Okorach there. His eye error, the man on the outside pointing to him that. Yeah, that was a very good conversion. Bouncing off the bar for a full complement of points. Zambia 7, Uganda 26. But you mentioned there Karim Arinaitwe, the protégé. He had his debut at the Safari 7s, the speedster. And he is in the right place this time to join his teammates in such a play. He's running support to Philip Okorak, but Philip Okorak won't need him. Breaking two tackles. And Karim Arinaitwe, like we saw with Wamala in Kenya, Karim Arinaitwe will get his first try of this tournament. For Team Uganda to extend their lead to 31 points to 7. His uh, contemporary, his favorite target, Philip Okorak. Gets to the try line and very generously passes the ball to the young. that on, but the referee says that went down and not forward. Great pass in the interplay. Balagad has been beaten by his man the second time. Good recovery tackle there by uh, Isaac Masa. Isaac Masa. Karina with the ball. He's a good with his ball in the hand. Nobato Kenyi. Arinaitwe midfield. Arinaitwe skins his man. Big tackle by the Zambians. 
Uganda still has the ball available. Calms things down. Goes back again in the midfield. Slices and dices. Goes all the way home for one more fantastic score for Uganda to make the score again. Something out of nothing there, Aaron O'Farrell. The man who started his rugby career at a very tender age here, at the very ground here at Channel Rugby Grounds. And then he has been made here. What a beautiful try. He didn't get to score that. He very generously awarded it to Isaac Massa. And now let's see what Philip Okorach can do with the conversion. Excellent scores. 40 points to Uganda, 7 to Zambia. Final score of the day. Uganda has consolidated their second victory. Fantastic play by the rugby train. Zambia, gallant effort. However, they live to fight another day. They have one victory. Final in group A. Uh, playing against uh, uh, Madagascar. And uh, again, Madagascar has to win that game to go through. And uh, Namibia versus Zimbabwe. Again, Zimbabwe with a chance to take themselves over. It's a very tight one in Group A. And um, in June. Uh, thanks for joining us. I've been Anesta Kolebi Runji. <laughs>